Welcome back. It's time for Coaching with Carrie. Oh boy, we're already, we, we were already <laughs> just talking about a commercial break, but that transition mm -hmm. from summer into fall, and it means a lot of things for a lot of people. A lot of people right now have colds yes. and are sick. I've heard, I've seen social media postings about people just kind of feeling down in the doldrums because the lack of light. Yes. And the change to the cold temps. Mm -hmm. So how can we make that transition better, Yeah, what you, what you guys didn't catch in the break, I was telling uh, Lisa, <laughs> I'm admitting, I'm a doctor's daughter, so when you're sick, you just go to school. <laughs> Fever, right? You don't. No, you don't. You don't. You don't and we were just joking sick. about that yeah. of, of how we're the worst patients. But yeah. um, no, and that's a, that's kind of the shift of the season means that we also have to shift how we take care of ourselves. Mm -hmm. So you got to think about like summer, we have more light. It's so what are we losing right now? So we're losing light. We're losing warmth. We're losing sleep. Also, I think we do a lot of like shifting in that too mm -hmm. as well. So you got to look at like how are you going to get what you're losing, okay? And so the one of the first things we talked about this last week with Chef Lori a little bit with our squash. Mm -hmm. So eating seasonally is really a really good idea. So I like to bring um, and also getting more color. So if you think about root vegetables, they think um, you know the whiter the potatoes. You know I always try to get more color in there because mm -hmm. the color is going to. The, the simplest way to bring that down is like when it has more color, it has more stuff in there that's good for you. What's the purple thing I can't see from this here? This one is cabbage. Oh, it's a cabbage. cabbage. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. That color is just really good yeah, for great. the fall, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So the more color you can get. And then also you want to think, like, this is a great time to go to the doctor and see what you need. So when you have less sunlight, it's going to affect your sleep schedule with melatonin. And then you're also not getting vitamin D, mm. which is very, very important for your bone health and many other things. So <laughs> this is where you want to think about. This is where a lot of the seasonal mood stuff kind yeah, of starts coming in. sure. Yep, and then light. You know, I've had my light. This is my Dawn Simulator. This is the one that I um, use at night. So what's really nice about it is that when you wake up in the morning, it just kind of brings this nice light. It's, it, it mimics the, the sun. Yeah. So I love this one, but I have the um, one at my desk. I've had Does this one here. Does that wake you up? Yes. Okay. But in Without a really an nice, alarm? Yeah, so if you actually, okay. so what I try to do is when I set it, I try to have it wake me up before my alarm's going to go off. Okay. So I still have the alarm just in case. Yeah. But it's really nice because it brings that really nice mimicking of the sound effect. Mm -hmm. And you can get it where that has sound effects as well. So it's like little birds tweeting. <gasps> That's nice. Yes. <laughs> How about maintaining motivation as we head into this season? Because in the summer, it's like, I'm going to grab my bike. I'm going to go for a walk. How yeah. do we continue to stay motivated? Because we're more active. And that's the other mm -hmm. thing is you think about just with foods in general in the summer. They have more water. They have the things that we need. We're more active in the summer when we don't even realize it. Mm. And so I think motivation for me especially is this is where I have to kind of get some of that external motivation where I'm right now I'm buddying up with somebody I'm booking classes somewhere um, you know using our movement motivator that we have on our website it's a free printable to kind of help you out um, to get that where I'm putting the clothes out the night before I'm, I'm booking the class I'm paying for that class because I think it's difficult you know in the morning when you want to do it, I'm like oh I want to just sleep in a little yeah. bit mm -hmm. yeah and so we also do um, in our house we have like little short circuits that we do as a family that we stay in how in the, where we don't want to leave to go to the gym so getting your family involved in music is really good. And then I also found signing up and registering for like the turkey trot or something sure. in the fall to look forward to will keep you motivated. Very nice. Okay, we can find all these on your website. Yep, yep. and now we have a new segment on the, fr on the front page of the website now that is dedicated to the Coaching with Carrie segments. Oh, so nice. So if you guys go on there, you just put your email there, you're going to get all these and then all the resources that we talk about. Okay, simplycarrie.com. Thanks, Carrie.